And here they come, the women. Now we'll go through the teams, Brownie, once I yeah. get set up. And well, I'll read out the Rabbitohs teams now. And the fullback is Molly Tagalola. Tagaloa. And number two is Paige Knapp. Yep. Number three, Patricia Rad Raka Droka. Sorry about the pronunciation. Number four, Michaela Ellie. Number five, Tasman Barber. Number six, Piku Piku Duff. Number seven, Sean Filippo. And in the forwards, we've got number eight, Marty Longford. Number nine, Janae Collins. Number ten, Sinetti Kilisamasi. Number eleven, Josephine Marges. Number twelve, Tia Cook. Number thirteen, Rachel Simpson. Number 14, Nikki Peringi. Number 15, Taimekwa Ty, Ty, Ty Duckett. Sorry to about that. Taimekwa, yeah. Taimekwa Duckett. Number 16, Emma Rene, Renema. And number 20, Nicole Backhouse. The Bulldogs at fullback, it's Abby Church. They've got on the wings, Georgia Ravix as they kick off. We'll go through it. And Saracen Oliver. In the centres, Shanai Lendl and Mahalia Murphy. The six is Anika Wilson. The halfback is... Let me just turn this around okay. the camera. So I'm filming here and talking as well. Uh, Renee Target. Uh, the Number eight is uh, Holly Wheeler. You might have heard of her. She plays for the Gillaroos. Number nine, Ruben Cherrington. The other front row is Tara McGrath-West. In the second row, we've got Sarah Saltier and Shanoa Amone. Sorry, I've missed that. Um, the 13 is Mona Lisa Soliola. On the bench, we've got Christy Sand. The girls, South girls, go downfield here, right in front of us here. Um, 15 is Teka, Te, Teka Ranga Katoa. Uh, and just like I said, I'm just trying to read and film. And uh, we've got Le- Leilani Wilson and Shannon Muru. That's Collins out of dummy half, looking to offload. Collins. A nice ball. Nice ball. Oh, what a pass. There we go. Oh, We're in. what a great pass there right. from Piku Duff. Number there six. You, there you go. And I think she's been named as one of the players to watch. Well, it is. And we're doing it with two. Exactly. So, she moves to in. your she view, well. I'll tell there. you what. Oh, yes, yes. And she's kicked it from the sideline. Beautiful kick there. Who was that, Brownie? What a great kick. Well, let's try and pick Get up the, the number. Pick up the number. What's this girl here? So, well, like I said, there are new, they are new to us. I was at training yesterday, but... Um, yeah, oh. she'll turn around in a minute and we'll get this number, Brownie, yeah, I think. Or maybe she won't. Yeah, she'll, she'll turn around. We'll get her number. And number four by the looks of it. Yeah. And it's Ellie. Michaela Ellie. What a great conversion from the sideline. Yes. To take the score to six points to nil over the Canterbury Bulldogs in the Harvey Norman women's game with 30 minutes to go in the first half. Yeah. For the bunnies. Finds a bit of space and gets in the clear. Sooner. Oh, it's on here. Oh. There, there's a bit of an issue. In the scrum. And they've stopped the play. They've stopped the play. I don't know what happened there. Yeah, just a... The player running in. There was a scrum there. Uh, the, the, they've got it under control, the officials. Like we're just saying... Can you see what happened there? Did we catch any of it, Brownie, or...? Yeah, it started from the scrum, maybe, and there was a bit of a, a, bit of a scuffle there. There wasn't too much in it. Rayla Droker, she's the captain. Yep. Oh, he's going, she's going to the send bin here. Oh, she's got 10 in the bin. Yeah. Dummy half. Passes at the target. Who gets the ball? They've got an overlap out here. They should score. And the Rabbitohs and the Bulldogs will go in in the corner with Georgia Rafix. So there's also number one, Abby Church. They got it from the Eels. She's quick, elusive, and scored a double last week. Saracen Oliver scored a double last week. There's that goal. That kicks. Oh, it's coming around, but no, it's too short. Into that heavy breeze. Is that it? That'll roll off his tongue, that one. Yep, as the Bulldogs are still on the attack here. They've been down this end of the field. And that was Abby Church. Turns the ball inside to Wilson. Wilson going for the line. Oh, she's on the Back ground to Church. There. And Church offloads out to Murphy. And Murphy will go in and score in the corner. Jeez, I the she... left-hand score. I thought she might have been tackled there, Brownie. Uh, Murphy oh, scores the second try for the Bulldogs, and that takes them to an eight points to six lead over the South Sydney Rabbitohs with 19 minutes to go. Daryl Lee, rice bubbles, milk chocolates, just to get us through, mate. Yeah, you might have to break it out with uh, a little bit of sugar or something, but they are good, Brownie, and that's our product of the month because Daryl Lee makes it better since 1927, and there's something special in every bite. In every let's, bite, well, let's there certainly see, is. Let's just see if this kick is special from... Uh, the number 13, 
who has and played at uh, Dana WNRL level. Soliola, and it goes across the face of the yeah. uh, goal mouth, well, and well, it's unsuccessful. Now yep. Bunnaby Water. Bunnaby Water. There it is. And a shout out to all our sponsors. We'll give them another. So, danger here now. They're going to have to hold them out. They got the player back now, so they're back. It's back to 13 on 13. But oh, great charge there from number 21, and that was Katrina Fippen. She put a, she put a team on the front foot, and a great pass there, a no look pass there from Anika Wilson. Yeah. And Saracen Oliver goes over for the try in the left-hand corner. Yep. What a great pass. Geez, some of those passes that these girls throw, that that's that NRL standard. Yeah, yeah and that's, uh, that's our man Johnny's hat, the Johnny the timekeeper, I think. <laughs> there he is there. Been around for a long, long time. Doing a great job. And he'll be blowing that hooter in 11 minutes 20 for the halftime siren. The doggies are up 12-6, so they're up a converted try with a kick to come. Yeah, I'm sure we've got some family members watching who appreciate the coverage. Probably Grant Chapel. He's gonna he's gonna try and catch the second half. She's As Charrington moves in, that away. yeah, it goes across the face of the uprights there. The girls in this pathway system, and she's put on a good shot there. Oh, and that's another, another good great tackle. tackle. That's the lock. Oh, geez, that was unfortunate. She got it for a flop. Oh, that sorry. was unfortunate. Number 20, Nicole Backhouse. She's come up with a couple of perler of the tackles. Uh, that's what you want. You want yeah, someone to come on and do some work. And there's there. another one. Gee. Nicole Backhouse, she just throws herself at the opposition. Uh, I know one thing. She needs an elastic, and there she is. I just spoke about her. Abby Church slices us up. Yeah. Uh, the Rabbitohs defence out wide. Well, the Rabbitohs didn't get to the church on time there, Brownie. Uh, it was yeah. how to speak Aboriginal language and culture. And culture. So it's water with a purpose. So thank Steve McDermott, Sean Garlic and all those for helping us out because it's great for our mental health for former players to get involved with uh, our mates. And speaking of former players, Mavo, just at the halftime break, I was talking to Wayne Snoopy Collins. Oh, uh, right. You, oh. you remember Wayne Snoopy Collins Gee. who was an assistant coach here uh, many a few years ago and a successful NRL player himself. And his daughter is actually number nine for the South Sydney Rabbitohs. Oh, and really? that's Janae Collins. And she's oh, having there you go. a oh, great game. Oh, gee, she could have caught that, the, the winger there. Yeah. So let's get let's look for a try. That's a big charge again. Oh, oh got she it picks away. it up. And there's a try, Brownie, under the sticks. And well-deserved. That's the number 20, I think. No, number 20, Nicole Backhouse. She's been outstanding all day as well, Mabo. Yeah, yeah, she has. She's really played above her weight, plays the game hard. And like I said, I think she needs a hair elastic for her hair. It's <laughs> bobbling around. Yeah, yeah, she's... Uh... But that's a try, well-deserved. A bit like Wild Man Robbo back in the day. He wouldn't wear an elastic. <laughs> he didn't care. So that's good. Where is she? Let's get her on camera. Nicole Backhouse. Where is she? She's, she ran back. There she is, Avery. Let's Just get her there. on. Let's get her on. Look at that. So, yep. She's played well, Brownie. Yeah, she has. She really, has. really uh, deserved that try. She's uh, been committed in defence. And, uh, you know, there's not much on the river. She's not like a, a, a giant of a girl. So she's just obviously tough as they come. Yes. And uh, we need this kick in front now. There she is. She's just had a look around. So she's having a spell, is she or no? No, she's coming on. No, you wouldn't be taking her off, Brownie, I don't think. Young backhouse. So, oh. Yeah, so well, this has brought life into the game. With thanks to NG Farrell's scoreboard, there's 20 to go. We're down 16-10 with a kick to come. It should be 16-12 shortly. And we We're within a try of this uh, going in the lead, Brownie. Well, we said we had to score next, and it's exactly what uh, young Nicole has done. She's put us in a position. As the fullback lines this up. lower. Take a lower, yep. Yeah. She was on the tip sheet. There's one to watch, and she's played well. And she and puts she it over, makes puts no it mistake. Over. There you go. And that takes the score to Canterbury Bankstown Bulldogs 16, the South Sydney Rabbitohs 12, with 19 minutes to go. To the field. There's a minute to go, Brownie. This game is almost done. Collins from dummy half. Good run there, beats one. From Longford. I think we've got to send it wide. We've got to throw it around, Brownie. They've got to try and them, these girls. Yes, we're going nice left. Nice ball. Yeah. Oh, it's oh, real forward. It is. And that should be the ball game. And she's copped a shot there, the 16 for a treble. 
16 points to 12 with only 35 seconds to go. And the Canterbury Bankstown Bulldogs should go on to win this game from here. Yes, they will. And we'll just leave you with this as, a, as the full time siren sounds. Bunnies TV is proudly brought to you by Daryl Lee, George's Cameras, Site Pizza, the Juniors Gripper Clubs, Dot Build Constructions, NG Farrow, Bunnaby Water, and Blast Pit. And that was right on cue there, Mavo, as the sponsors get a mention, and so they deserve, but well-deserved winners as well to the Canterbury Bankstown Bulldogs. They run out winners, 16 points to 12 over the South Sydney Rabbitohs women's team. And look, uh, all four games today, Mavo, uh, it's been a great effort from the Rabbitohs and a credit to the Bulldogs. We spoke to some of their staff earlier in Barry Ward and Shane Millard, and they've got some great systems put in place. They have, mate, yep. And it's been a big day. We're going to wrap it up there. Um, and who, there's Barry down there. Where is he, Wardy? There he is. We'll get, we'll get him on there. He's a uh, yeah. former teammate. He's, he's a great he's, man, Baz. Yeah, there he is. He's we doing just... great things at the Bulldogs. And uh, another man who's doing great there is uh, Phil Gould, who's putting things in place. And this club is going to be a force to be reckoned with in a couple of years' time, let me tell you. Yep. Especially at the top level, uh, where they've signed a number of players this year. And they've still got some money left to sign players for next year. And I just want to give a shout out to all the live people who have watched this live and chatted and donated throughout the day. It's been an awesome day for Bunnies TV where we've brought you four live games here at Redfern Oval. Thanks for joining us on Bunnies TV live and free. We'll see you next time as the girls huddle up out there. It's been a big day. And thank you, Rob Trelaw. He said the live feed. Thanks for the live feed, highly appreciate it, and we appreciate the feedback. See you later. See you guys.